Yo guys, what's up? Today you are going to want to watch this video because today I'm going to be giving away my scuff. So you gotta watch this whole entire video. That is the key because somewhere in this video is going to be a code, a word, a phrase, something in this video. Yeah, might be a little trickery, but it's a scuff. It's yours. Just gotta watch the video. And I'll send it to you once you figure it out. Anyways, guys, let's get into what this video is really about. But let me just say, me giving away this scuff is more of a thank you for people that have subscribed to this channel and commented on my videos um, in the past 25 years because I make videos so randomly and I'm not very committed. I'm committed in my mind to make videos. I'm just not... Anyways, let's talk about what this video is about. Besides the fact that I'm giving away a scuff and you gotta watch the video in order to figure out how to get the scuff. So, what we're talking about today is silicone thumb grip versus um, control freaks. Now, I've been using control freaks for a very long time and I can tell you that control freaks are good. They're awesome. I need them. I gotta have them. I gotta have some type of grip. I can't raw dog all right see i'm in one of those moods where just about everything i say is going to be a meme or freezing and um it's hard i can't snap out of it once i'm in it so anyways i bought these and they come in a huge pack and i'll show you on the screen right now So they're basically a pack like this, a big ass pack. I don't know why you need this many, I don't know, but I will give some of these away as well. So, once upon a time, I just wanted a grip because as I became better with my controller abilities, my skills, man, my, my controller skills. That skills, I got mad skills, bro. As I became better, I saw this on Amazon and I bought it. With that grip came these little thumb stickies thingamajiggies the silicone this one is shiny because it's been used for so long but they look like this when they're brand new I bought another one and you know what I'll give this way too so it comes with these and they're smaller and um, then I went like a couple weeks ago I went looking for the grips and just the grips by themselves without the actual body grip because this actual silicone pad doesn't fit on the scuff because of the, the sticks and as you can see. So you can also buy control free grips, okay? And the control free grips are sticky and they wrap around the controller um, and they're very, very sticky. Like they're totally different than like a silicone which can be somewhat slippery in like a, it smells like a charcoal, like a barbecue, like, wow, well, scary. Um, very interesting. Yeah, interesting. So control free grips, they go on, they're very sticky. I'll tell you right now, they don't come off all that well. And I can show you a picture of one. So these here, the ones that come with the actual body glove are smaller. And then you can buy these ones, which I believe will fit like PS4 and Xbox. Now, here's the thing. Look at the sticks. You see the sticks? This is the diameter of the sticks. If I go straight on, you can see that the, that the head of the stick, right? The part you actually touch is almost the same diameter, diameter as this edge here, right? You see that, right? Okay. Now, when we take these guys, which I absolutely adore, and we put them on like so and they really just kind of you know just hook one corner and like just kind of pull and, and slide it over yeah this ain't working anyways you slide them on that's it you slip them on like you'd slip on a friggin slipper it's pretty simple just kind of wipe it on and once it's on there by the way it's not gonna slip it's not gonna move it's not gonna do anything now look at how wide everything's backwards man Look at how look at how wide this is compared to this. Like look at all that mo that much more surface area you have. And it's not like the edges are like baggy cuz they're not. That's what's really cool. And then these studs are really strong. They're 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 tough. 
So on the ones here, the smaller ones that come with this, with this case, they're a little bit more narrow and the studs are a little bit more like in the, in the middle of your thumb. And then these ones are wider and they're more like towards the outside. It's just wider, right? So side by side, big difference, huge difference, huge. So I love these, but then I, I got this and I kind of had like the new, I had like the old one on here, like so, and then I had a new one like that, right? So it was like, like that. And I never really took it off until just now making this video. So I slipped it on prior to making this video because this video has been pre-recorded 17 times already. Cause that's just the way it goes. You talk, you talk, you look down at the clock and it's like, wow, really? I've been talking for 34 minutes. Is that a scuff controller code? 34 minutes. So you slip these on and then voila, we have it. Look how wide that is. Look like, like your sticks become that much wider. Like it's as wide as the actual, like the base, Do you want the, the base, everything's backwards. That base, it's that wide. It comes all the way out to that edge. See? Well, almost, but close. Here, up close and personal. These things are awesome. They got that little concave in there. And then like, it's like your thumbs are in. It's like your thumbs just sit in there and they don't wanna slide out because of the studs. And the studs are really firm. So at first you might feel it and think, uh, these are uncomfortable. Like these ones here are much more narrower. So to give you an idea, let's see if we can, see if we can hold that in place. Holy it's not working, you know what? I can just do it this way. So these ones are much narrower. So that, so the, the, the studs, are going to be more in the center of your thumb. So initially, when you put your thumb on it after buying it, put it on your controller, you put your thumb on it, you're gonna be like, eh, it's a little, little, little rough, right? But I'm telling you, man, it, it just feels so much better. And like the overall control is really, really nice. Control freaks are awesome. I'm not sponsored by anybody in this video, obviously. I'm a tiny little YouTuber who makes YouTube videos once every 17 years. Unfortunately, trust me, I wanna make videos every day, trust me. So, um, these make a huge difference. That's the whole point of this video. Besides me giving away a scuff, these make a huge difference, like, like a big difference. So, example, I've used these QBCs, these close quarter combat uh, control freaks so much that they are shiny and they actually feel slimy. You can see one is more, this one is more like polished and run down than this one because this one's a left stick, this one's a right stick. So this one's getting used way more, right? So now they're useless because once you sweat, I mean even just slightly, you're, you're slipping all over the place. It's like, totally useless then you get something like this right you have the phantoms which have much more of a silicone they're more grippy um, and a way to make these grippy er by the way is if you get some alcohol and rub them down with alcohol or dunk them in alcohol whatever and then wipe it off aggressively it will bring back that texture because the alcohol it's way over there the alcohol is basically like a solvent and it's gonna break it down it's gonna make it like tackier so you can bring them back to life like that. Thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, please drop a like on it because I need to grow, you know, like I need my YouTube channel to grow so I can go from 500 subs to 500,000 subscribers by the summertime. By July, we're going to hit 500,000 and by the end of the year in December, going for 1 million subscribers. You're looking at me like I said something that was weird. I, I don't know what you're saying. I'm out.